Are we back? Are we back? It's your boy Crypto Million back with another one. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the entire cryptocurrency market. We're going to go on another rant, man. Crypto news in the morning. Make sure that you like and subscribe. And I got a question for everybody, family. What would we be without meme coins? It seems like every time a meme coin pumps, it just injects the cryptocurrency space with energy we've never seen, family. In fact, meme coins is like the nitro in crypto. You know what I'm saying? You ever watch Final? Uh, what's that? Uh, 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 what's that? Um, Fast and the Furious, and you just see they, when they hit the nitro button. That, that, that's what meme coins do. They kind of ignite crypto currency we're seeing altcoins finally having some type of life in the cryptocurrency space and that's what we want to see uh leave a comment let me know what y'all think about meme coins and what's up with this ftt F <laughs> this thing is pumping man like after everything that ftx put people through people still buying this unreal unreal all right so let's get into some of this uh this, this crypto news so uh bitcoin went through uh some options today i think the bitcoin option price was right around um it was right around like twenty six thousand, and the ethereum option price was was 1700 and bitcoin held right between 30 and thirty thousand. so that's a good thing that's a good thing that means we are bullish because the bears are no longer in the control and the bulls seem to be pushing bitcoin in the entire cryptocurrency space to the upside as you can see right here um this was the um expiration of price of those options as far as bitcoin and ethereum so it's good to see that cryptocurrency is holding up family i want Oh, we crossed 31,000 right while I'm making the video. Let's go, baby. Bitcoin is on a roll. You got to understand what's happening inside the cryptocurrency space right now. You got a lot of institutional interest with the fan grease sitting at a 59. Not bad, but BlackRock kind of like set a forest fire inside the cryptocurrency space. Now you got all of these companies working on bitcoin spot etfs which is making crypto back bullish but we gotta understand family that we haven't yet flashed green on the goshen channel uh from the last well we go back in history the last time before we flashed green it took us approximately 70 days how long will it take <laughs> because this is the weekly chart yeah i, I gotta make that clear i, I time out i gotta make that clear for the people because they be like really i thought this was these are weekly charts when i'm looking at bitcoin when i'm looking at the total altcoin market i like to look from the weekly chart family so it gives me an idea about where we're going technical analysis is not it's not the everything all okay it's not the everything all it just gives you an idea of where the momentum is going and then you can pick your spots but always do your research always do your due diligence and try to learn something new every day inside cryptocurrency i, I think that matters i think that matters but 31k bitcoin bitcoin has just crossed 31k as i'm making a video uh the tether dominance is falling that's what you want we want to see because we we was up we was hanging up out here for like it seemed like weeks family so we finally got the tether dominance falling and we also got the dxy flashing red and also falling so a lot of bullish um but um a lot of bullish things happening from a technical analysis standpoint so from a tna standpoint we got a lot of bullish developments it is the weekend it is the weekend and next month going into july 26 days until the fomc meeting it is a 89 percent family of a 0.25 federal rate hike so yes j pal came out and was like look y'all can't pump yet he put his foot down and said expect two more yes two more federal rate hikes family so that's pretty much what's going on in the cryptocurrency space. We got a little bit of Pepe news, um, but I will be doing some altcoin videos a little bit later. Uh, I'll probably do a Jasmine video and an HBAR video. Man, so many things are happening with Jasmine and HBAR. I'm excited to do those videos. And uh, salute to the HBAR and the Jasmine community for always showing up, man. Always showing up and supporting. I also want to make sure I do an Elon video. It's a very, very important Elon video that I'm doing a little bit later today. So be looking out for that. 
but let me know what you think about the cryptocurrency market and the fact that it's puppet will bitcoin finally pump over 33k will ethereum pump over 2k and what's up with pepe 2.0 man pepe 2.0 is literally sending again in fact i listened to a pepe 2.0 um space where it was hosted by pepe 2.0 i don't know if that was the founder or the dev i know your pop was in the space but it was just so many people in the space and it was giving me vibes of the original pepe how those twitter spaces family started to pump the token i hope a lot of you meme coins are paying attention to uh other on a marketing standpoint how to do this you feel me twitter spaces in fact it's been motivating me to be more active on twitter man pepe 2.0 is pumping i know a lot of people doubted it maybe this might be the second chance family i'm not gonna make too much speculation on it and the original yes the original pepe is also pumping man it's looking good for our favorite meme coins y'all let me know i'm using <coughs> i'm losing my voice on this joint y'all let me know what y'all think about these meme coins, the entire cryptocurrency space. Are we going to the moon? Are we going to the moon? It's your boy Crypto Millie. I'll see you in the next one.